Hello guys, this is Mauro from PrintFotech.com and on this video we'll go through the steps to upgrade to the Windows 10 Spring Creators Update or version 18.03. An upgrade instead of doing a clean installation allows you to keep your files, apps and settings. In other words, it is like installing a quality update like those you install every month but with the difference that version 18.03 brings new features and big improvements. Although upgrading to a new version of Windows 10 is usually an easy process, it is always recommended to create a full backup before proceeding. You can check the video notes below to find a link to watch the video with the steps to do a full backup of your computer. Technically, there are three ways to upgrade to a new version of Windows 10. One is using Windows Update, which is a recommended process. And when the update is ready on your device, you will get a notification to use the settings app to install the update. So if you get a notification, you simply go to the settings app and then on updated security on Windows Update, just click the uh, install button and the Spring Creator Subtitle will install on your computer. After April 10th, 2018, when the update is supposed to be available to everyone, if you don't get a notification on your device, you can always force the update by just clicking the uh, Check for Updates button. Then the second option is to use the Update Assistant, which is a tool that Microsoft makes available for devices that are not receiving the update through Windows Update for some reason. Third, you can use the media creation tool to install Windows 10 version 18.03 on your computer doing an in-place upgrade or creating a bootable media that you can use to upgrade your machine. In this video, we'll be using the media creation tool to do an in-place upgrade. Before proceeding, to avoid upgrade problems, disconnect any peripherals from your computer, such as printer, Bluetooth devices, USB drives, and external storage. You only need a keyboard, mouse, displayed. Also, it is recommended to uninstall all their software, security applications, and more importantly, third-party antivirus. You can always install them back later after the upgrade. If you don't do this, you're likely to run into errors and other problems. To upgrade your computer to the latest version of Windows 10, you need to download the media creation tool from this Microsoft support website. You can find the link in the video notes below to download the tool. Once you're on the website, click the download tool now button and then just double click the tool. Click accept. Because we're going to be doing an in-place upgrade, select the upgrade this PC now and click next. Click accept to agree to the terms. Sometimes when using the media creation tool, downloading updates to continue with installation might get stuck. If this happens, one workaround is to disconnect your device from the network and continue with the process. And then after the installation, you can reconnect your PC to finish the setup. One way you can do this is just to go to the uh, network connections on control panel and just simply right click the uh, network connection and click disable. You can also unplug the uh, network cable from your computer or if you have a wireless connection. If you have a button on your keyboard or on your device that turns off the uh, wireless connectivity, you can use that option as well. Finally, we're ready to install the Spring Creator Subdate. Because we're doing an in-place upgrade, you will notice that we have the uh, key personal files in apps. So make sure that this is listed on your screen as well. Now, the last thing left to do here is to click the install button.
And now you have successfully upgraded your device to version 1803. The entire installation process takes around 45 to 60 minutes, depending on the hardware and your internet connection. The quickest way to check if you're running the Spring Creator subject is to look at the uh, taskbar because you're going to find a new task menu button, as you can see right here. And also opening the uh, settings up, you will see a new layout. And when you go to any of the sections, you will find the acrylic effect part of the uh, Fluent Descent system that is part of the uh, new settings up experience. Please make sure to check the video notes for important information such as the release date of this new version of Windows 10 and much more. Also remember that if you try to use the media creation tool before the update is officially available, your device won't install the Spring Creator update on your computer. Lastly, if the update is working correctly on your computer, if you're not having any issues, you can go to the settings app and on system, storage, click and change how we free up space automatically. Under free up space now, you can click this option and click the uh, clean now button to delete the previous version of Windows 10 to free up space on your computer. And that's all there is to it. Remember to like the video, share it, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing.